our vision is to support a flourish in Scotland, so we've decided to aim for 2040 to be net zero. In Scottish Water, provide water and wastewater services for the whole of Scotland. So that's 2.6 million households. One of the biggest challenges is the geography. We have high population areas, but we have a lot of remote small sites as well, both water and wastewater works. So uh, a big difference in size and scale of assets and a very disperse uh, customer base and operational workforce. So we were having problems all the time um, when it was full of rags from the camper site, just up in the hill. You know, you'd have rubbish, bags, jeans, uh, pants and all that kind of thing. Um, and that just all builds up. So the old pumps that ran off this control panel here, they were faulty every, every month. They were constantly down here at the time, having to organize contractors to come down and lift the pumps. And we were all constantly having to buy new pumps because all the pumps weren't coping with what was coming into the wet well. So this, this box was installed in 2018 by um, Xylem and it's worked tremendously well. We've had no, no problems with it ever since, no call outs, no lorries, no, hardly any manpower and man time. So the good communication, the guys were pretty great and knew what they were doing um, and have installed a, a perfect system. We have had energy reduction to reduce downtime, reduce call outs, reduce jokes in the pump, so less service disruption and less risk of environmental impact as well to our pumping stations. We've still got a long way to go to be net zero in Scottish water, which is our ambition. Anything that reduces downtime as a water company is um, absolutely where we should be and what we should be focusing on.